All right, the book ban controversy. I mean, it's played out in schools and libraries all across the nation. We have seen, we have heard both sides in our state. And tonight, that debate took center stage again at a packed meeting in Rio Rancho. The main Rio Rancho library was overflowing this evening. It's more than 100 people showed up. That's after there was a call online for protests in support of banning books, mostly involving LGBTQ issues. But that's not what happened. Tonight's crowd was anti-book ban, far different from the group we heard from months ago at a Rio Rancho City Council meeting. No rational parent would allow their child to view this despicable material. It is for the sake of protecting our children, our teenagers. We all probably have teenagers and know they're not fully fledged, reasoning adults. Why would sexually oriented materials harmful to minors be allowed in our public libraries? Spencer Shaw has been following the back and forth in Rio Rancho and Spencer tonight's meeting seemingly kind of backfired on those calls uh, for books to be banned or at least for the presence of people who want the books to be banned. That's right and basically everyone who signed up more than 20 people spoke publicly tonight. Mm -hmm. Everyone who spoke to at tonight's meeting was against book banning. Yep. Signs in hand, many people showed up to the Rio Rancho Public Library Monday night with a clear message, no book bans. We don't want to have people say what books cannot or can be in the library. The books that they may not want their children to read, I may want my children to read. And so they can certainly control it at home, but they shouldn't restrict books, make choices for everybody about what books people should read and not read. While there was nothing on the City Library Board's agenda dealing with book bans, the large turnout Monday night was because of this tweet, posted by the conservative group New Mexico Mass Resistance. It called for followers to show up at their meetings to defend the heterosexual nuclear family. But the tweet ended up having the opposite effect. We the people will not be moved. We the people will continue to show up every time to make sure that we continue to have the freedom to read what we want it's important. As we reported the first time we saw this debate play out during a Rio Rancho City Council meeting back in April, the city has a formal process to request the removal of books from public libraries. You simply fill out a request for reconsideration form to have the book reviewed and possibly removed. But to this very day, we have not had a single one of those requests in this calendar year. Um, I have not seen a single one. Now, earlier this year, the city of Rio Rancho passed a resolution saying that they are going to stand behind any decision that the libraries make when it comes to their collections. And so far, it's just been noise, no yes. action. Okay. Spencer, thanks.